Hello, welcome to my channel. Today I am showing you all to make a grated uh, mango pickle which was requested by a viewer. The ingredients are, I wash these mangoes, they are about 10 green mangoes but you can go to green to half ripe and then a few cloves of garlic not very much of a garlic this is quite big garlic there's about four mustard seed uh, half a teaspoon of sugar half a teaspoon of salt but you can add more to your taste a teaspoon of uh, pickle masala and half a teaspoon of pure chili powder but you can go with more chili powder if you like it hot half a cup of oil and thereafter I have a grater of which I'm gonna peel my mangoes and grate it it's good to do it with the food processor but it becomes difficult if you cut the hard seeds then it will crush all your white and your hard and it becomes bitter. It's best to do it with your grater in your hand. And then a grinder to crush my garlic roughly. And we must have a dishcloth to squeeze out the excess water. I will show you all how it's done. I've got my stove on. The first step is to add in your oil into the pot. To heat up and then add in your mustard seed and allow it to a little sizzling fry because mustard seed get black very quick and while you can see the mustard seeds are frying a little you have to switch your stove hot uh, off and allow your oil to get absolutely cool okay while the oil is getting cooled down i am going to start peeling my mangoes which was already washed and dried up these mangoes are half ripe Yes, uh, you can do a lot of items with mangoes. Like you can put mango into the dal, you can make mango pickle, you can make a uh, kuchla, you can make mango curry, you can make mango ice cream. To make kuchla is best to have when your mangoes are just getting half ripe see these are the seed that will remove and you can see it has a hard arty that's what we call it, a seed these white seeds actually make your pickle turn bitter if you had them so always remove them and thereafter we start a great There's a way to use your grater. You always go downwards and not continuous. See, this is for throwing. If you use a food processor, that would get processed. Then. Which will make it bad. Yeah. So it's This is the mangoes, 10 mangoes that I grated and this is much that much it come to. And thereafter, I will take, you can use any type of a cotton cloth but the dish cloth is the best. I place it into a dish like this and then put in my grated mango into the center of 
Вот. And then wrap it up tightly. And this is what we do to take the excess extra juices out that make your kuchla become sour. There you are, the extra water, which is for throwing away. And you're squeezed out. Grated mango. After it is squeezed out, you can add your sugar, your salt. Your pickle masala, your pure chili powder, which is option, not necessary. And there we will grind our garlic roughly. We put in our garlic and the oil that is absolutely cold. You see, it's not burnt out. So you pour in your oil. If you use hot oil, your mango might get cooked. You can add more oil if you want to keep it for a longer period. But this is just a little mix well. And in fact, this goes very well with your chicken curry, not only vegetables. You can add on more masala if you like. And when you taste, you can add on your salt to your liking. I normally call this kuchla. There's your kuchla. Thank you very much. And thank you to the viewer that requested it.